The Outer Banks. Paradise on Earth. And that's me. John Booker Rutledge. And this is where I live. Here's what you can get for one cent. You can get a used bag with a used sticker. You won't be getting a bracelet. I'll be generous, so I'll give you a bead. And along with some string. And as a freebie, I'll give you three pearls. No jewelry bag. Thanks for ordering. If you dance, I'll dance. And if you don't, I'll dance anyway. Give things a chance. Let the fear you have fall away. I've got my eye on you. <laughs> can look like me. ka -chow. Y'all not ready for this. Customer says every time she wears any of her healing crystals, they end up on the floor as she's driving. But she never sees them come off. She wants to know what that means. New AP. Flood. Water on my butt like a tub. They got my little gun in the club. Don't worry about me. I'm a thug. You kill a street nigga, get a dime.
chocolate spoons, and I saw that my brother tapped his bracelet to remind me he's with me. You may find this hard to believe, but not everyone wants to go to Yale because not everyone wants to be Blair Waldorf. Not everyone can be. How much my bracelets would cost when I will sell them? Four dollars. Three dollars and fifty cents. Three dollars. هاي اليوم الاوردر لبنوت اسمها ليليان طلبت خلخال وبريسلت وحبيت يكون في كل الالوان سو حضرت لها اياهم وفي كمان معهم بريسلت صغيره لصبي زختور شو رايكم؟ My crystal bracelets and their meanings Understanding and inspiration Love and forgiveness Positive transformations Joy and manifestations Releasing anxiety Protection and grounding Abundance and prosperity The Outer Banks, paradise on earth. And that's me, John Booker Rutledge. And this is where I live. It's the sort of place where you either have two jobs or two houses. Two tribes, one island. That's my crew. We're the working class who make a living busing tables, running charters. It's brutal out of here. Guess you didn't cheat. My driver's license last week It's always one step forward and three steps back Do you get deja vu when she's with you? But honestly, I just need to be a little crazy Here. Guess you didn't cheat, but you're still a traitor. I got my driver's license last week. It's always one step forward and three steps back. Do you get things up from when she's with you? Well, good for you, you look happy and healthy, not me. So there I am. On a date with a guy I've been seeing for about three weeks. All is going well and afterwards, we go back to his place. Fast forward and we're in the shower. He's a seven in one shampoo, body wash, car oil, also functions as ketchup kind of guy. Surprisingly, he presents me this new soap someone had made him. Smells great, so there I go, washing my body, impressed that he actually has such nice soap. 
Within moments, my vagina is ablaze. Something is wrong. I remove myself from the shower as gracefully as I can while panicking. My kitty is swelling, becoming huge. Like lips aren't covering this anymore and it's just getting bigger and bigger. While he's still showering, I call my mother, I know, frantically. I'm explaining in great detail what's happening while panicking. I have seriously grown a small wiener at this point. I'm staying as quiet as possible while a show plays in the background. Little do I know, this dude has supersonic hearing and has heard my whole panicked details. Yesterday, I was supposed to spend the night at my friend's house with some of my classmates and we were playing truth or dare. There really is no reason for us to choose truth since we already know a lot about each other, so we mostly just went with theirs. It was pretty fun and we had some weird challenges. I was sitting next to my friend's brother when it was my turn and a classmate challenged me to kiss him. His sister immediately told my friend to change the dare and so she did. To be clear, her brother didn't say anything when he heard about the dare and just laughed so he definitely looked like he was okay with it, right? Well, wrong, because after I kissed him, he told me what the fuck am I doing and he looked like he was really grossed out by it. I was honestly a bit offended and asked him why he was so grossed out by me kissing him. I'm actually a pretty okay looking girl and even if I wasn't, there was no reason for him to act like this. He ended up leaving the game and my friend told me that what I did was wrong on so many levels and to get out of her house. My other classmates didn't say anything so I think they were on my side but they didn't want to participate in this argument. I'll ask them when they go back home. Anyway, I did يعني إذا حدا سألني شو أكثر شي بايع بهالسنة هن هود الأساوي ما معقول قد ايه العالم حبتهم وعم تطلبهم هلا يمكن لأنه أول شي فيكم تحطوا أساميكم ولكل الأعمار بتطلع كمان حلوة يعني حتى في الأساوي بفيديو قبل بعرف إذا حاضرين تبع الفريندز كمان نبيع منهم كتير بس بضل هولي منبيع منهم أكتر بكتير أوقات عن جد فكرة صغيرة معقول تكون أهم من كتير أشياء يعني ليكو قدش بيطلعوا مهضومين فيكن تهدون فيكن انتو تاخدون لإلكن مثل العادة عطول بقلكن انو فيكن تنقوا حيالله لون حبل وانتو تعملوا الاسوار على زوقكن لانو حتى الخرس تبع الاحرف كمان في منهم الوان سو بتلبقوا على زوقكن I was in Bloomingdale's today and happened to end up next to two teenage girls while shopping. One of the girls had picked out a pair of very expensive boots and they were fawning over them. The second girl must have looked at the price tag and asked the boots girl if she's really going to spend that much on boots. Girl with the boots said something along the lines of, it's fine, I have my dad's credit card, I'm not paying. Which instantly caught my attention because that's not her card. I told my son multiple times he's never allowed to use my card, so I'm interested to see how this girl thinks she's going to get away with fraud, but had to split up from the girls at this point because they had found something else. We ended up at the same register, me behind, and I see her total hit well over four digits. The girl is about to swipe her card when I decide that I can't let her get away with something like this, and someone has to parent this kid if no one else will. I tell the cashier that isn't her card but her father's and I'm not sure if she has permission. The girl and friend turn to glare at me, giving me possibly the dirtiest look I've ever seen. I swear this girl was going to throw a tantrum right there. I don't think she was ever told no. The girl tells the cashier that her father gave her the card to shop with because it's the store's credit card and it gives him points. Now that I've pointed out that it wasn't hers, the cashier tells her that she can't use that card. The girl tries to show the ID to prove that they have the same last name. Yeah, that'll help. So my dad goes to auctions and finds boxes of jewelry that isn't the cutest. And I take it and take apart the necklaces or whatever it may be and I make it into something cute. Here's an example of something I've made. So you guys can come through this box with me and see what we can find. Right off the bat, I found these two bracelets with these butterfly charms in them. And I found this long beaded necklace with a few types of beads in it, so I might be using those. These green beads might be good for something. I also always tend to find like random little beads and charms, so I found these. got this red with these really cute stars. And I found another red one. I'm not sure if I can do anything with this, but I do kind of like these interesting beads. I found this interesting necklace, but these seed beads I can so use for multiple necklaces. Here's some orange beads, and this is really good for seed beads. These little blue beads, I'm probably going to cut this and then use the little ones in between the pearls because I usually do like pearl necklaces with this kind of stuff. So stay tuned for a video of me. Okay, so for those of you asking where I got my bracelets or to see my bracelets, I will tell you. So don't leave, okay? Okay. <laughs> okay. Don't mind my chiquito arms, bro. Like, don't. Just don't look at them if you don't like them all. I hear my dad talking. <laughs> Okay, so this one, is, my dad got it for me. I don't know from where. Uh, this one says my name, and it's from Mexico. This one says cutie, and my friend bought it for me from school. This one, I made. This one is like my favorite one. It says, I'm not going to say it, but like, it's very inspirational. I made it. <laughs> this one, I made as well. These two, my cousin made for me. as like a friendship thingy. I don't know. This one, my mom gave it to me. I don't know if I'm right. And then these four, they have like, these are from the Swamp Me. Um, this one, who that's one? From the Swamp Me, my dad got it for me. This red evil, this red evil eye bracelet. Pretty sure it's from the Swamp Me. I don't know, my dad got it for me as well. 
And this one says, I love Texas, and it's from Texas, and my dad got it for me. Um, uh, the necklaces, for those of you asking, I don't know, because this one of San Judas, my dad bought it for me when I was, like, little, so, like, I really have no idea. And then this one was my mom's, but, like, she doesn't wear her jewelry, and I get mad because she doesn't wear them. So I took it away, and I was like, you know what? I'm going to wear it. <laughs> so that's it. joking you're joking yeah, make her take her to the flow we'll show her how you roll get it 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 it's hard to believe i'm walking through the ruins of the first ever city because i'm not that's in iraq which is Gorgeous, gorgeous girls support small businesses. Gorgeous, gorgeous girls have a pink package on the way. You're joking. You're joking. You know what I mean. Taking off a skirt, let her wear my shirt before she leave. I'm gonna need my shirt back. Nigga, you know Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, bad bitches have bad days too. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, bounce back, hot bad bitch always do. from Auspac, mailing boxes, shredded tissue filler, bubble mail. Unbox my projection bracelet with me. Wait until you see what it does. You can get whatever image you want. Linking bio. I take the ball, I bounce it. I shoot, I miss it. Oh! Returns. This one was returned due to incorrect address. It only had slight damage to the sticker. Well, everything looks in great conditions. Only a slight dent on the car. All the products look great. Help you cross the street? No. I could help you cross your yard? No. I could help you cross your porch? No. Well, I gotta help you cross something. Guys, I need some help. So I ordered these pearls and they were meant to be this big. But this is what I got. Just look at the difference. They are too big for bracelets. What should I do with them? Comment below. Kate 
ordered a large and medium mystery pack. I am using a super durable box from Oz Pack. I also had to add the freebies. I then added some pink filler also from Oz Pack. Isn't this just the cutest? Now we just close up the box. I used to be so afraid to post videos of my business. I was convinced people from my hometown would be sending my videos back and forth in their group chat and talking about how I thought I was some big business owner. And you know what? I am. And I'm going to keep posting my videos because it's been proven time and time again that one video can quite literally change a person's life. I was packing orders when I saw this note. Hi, could you please film this? I don't have a lot of money, so I couldn't order much. Sorry, I really wanted more jewelry. Don't feel bad if you can't order a lot. Lots of people think if they don't order much, they aren't helping my business. I appreciate a $5 order the same as a $50 order. All orders really help my business no matter the size. After getting a bunch of orders, I was thinking of the people who add things to their carts but never check out. I can actually see everyone who abandons their cart. This made me think about the people who want to order but can't afford it. So I picked an order and decided to pack this order up and send it to them for free. I emailed them so they don't think they accidentally ordered it. No, I don't think you understand. I'm obsessed.
Bracelets are beautiful, but I can't buy them. That's completely fine. I understand that not everyone can afford to purchase a bracelet, especially during this pandemic. And I don't want anyone to feel pressured to order from me. Just a simple like, follow or share can help my business out so much. But if you did want to go order, my link is in my bio. This song is two seconds long. 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 If your friends don't respond with this emoticon, they don't watch your video. Conversations with customers. Hi, I ordered last year and I still haven't got it. Me, what was your order number? You didn't give me one. Me, I'm sorry I can't give you a refund if you don't have the information. Okay, fine, I was faking it. Me, please don't try to scam small businesses. We're rich. We're rich. We're the rich. <laughs> Sheen they're a dollar. Yes, the bracelets of Sheen are a lot cheaper because Sheen is a huge company with thousands of workers who can mass produce products unlike me who hand makes each individual bracelet. Because mine are a bit more expensive, I 100% understand if you can't afford to purchase a bracelet, but if you wanted to support my business, a like, follow or share helps me out just as much. But if you wanted to purchase, I just restocked and the link is in my bio. It's really not that bad. It just needs a little... <laughs> Shaping <laughs> to the salon. <laughs>
One dollars for a Krabby Patty with cheese, Mr. Squidward. Okay, well, that's you. But on the other hand, me? Oh, I'm gonna turn up. Tell a story ain't nobody buying Look me in my eyes Don't Deep throat with a lift to my whistle Lord, Come give me a chill Deep throat what you put my food Dark energies we don't touch Artillery's me on touch And I got a colorful aura Like I got neon guts Dark energies we don't touch Artillery's me on touch And I got a colorful aura Like I got neon guts Some help. I have thousands of beads but don't have any design ideas. Do you have any ideas? My money don't jiggle jiggle, it folds. I like to see you wiggle wiggle for sure and make you wanna dribble dribble, you know. Let's play a game. Try to name this bracelet without the word flower. The best name will be pinned.
Oh my gosh, I just love your matching dresses. Really? No. Myself wondering what did happen to the last ten? I ran away with my life fast forward, never turned back again. It's kind of funny that the more we pass time, the more we need to set the rewind. And 19 was the year I had to leave you, but now I'm seeing all the signs. Is this really happening? I can't believe it's true. I'm just as surprised as you. bracelets are $6 and I do have to pay for materials and packaging supplies. So it's quite reasonable and I understand not everyone can afford to purchase but a like, follow or share helps me out just as much. The dash is busy, the schedule busy, my head in a hoodie, my shorty a goodie, my cousins are crazy, my cousins like boogie, life is amazing, it is what it should be. Been here for 10 but I feel like a rookie, I tell her look up cause it's snowing in tussies. My business cards arrived, but I ordered the wrong amount. Wait till you see how many there are. I mean, at least they're cute. What should I do with all them? Someone please help. Story time with a Karen. I just got my order, but there's a problem. I'm so sorry. What's the issue? I got the phone charm, but that's it. You only ordered a phone charm. Yes, but where is the phone? Story time with another influencer. Mean makes video using a similar bracelet design and gives her credits. Messages me. The bracelet design is special to me so please don't sell it in your shop. Me oh okay. What would you do in this situation? Okay, let's pack an order together. So we're gonna get a shiny bag, chuck that down there, and then we're gonna model for you because we love that. Cute little business card and a lolly that's gonna aggressively be thrown. And now we're gonna get a cute cactus sticker and uh, transition into confetti, but she didn't finish it. And now we're gonna get a sticker and I hope you enjoy your bracelets with a side of grass. Why don't you wear gloves when making bracelets? This is a great question. The reason is it takes a lot longer with gloves. To show you, I filmed myself making a bracelet with gloves. It was very hard to put the beads on because the gloves were a bit too big, but it ended up taking just over 10 minutes. Then I timed myself making the exact same bracelet without gloves. As you can see, it was a lot easier to put the beads on and only took four and a half minutes. We're the wretch. We're the wretch.
page. You were good. I'm waiting for you to be great. And next, Kendall. You didn't stick out to me. Next is Brooke. Next, Nia. You're third on the pyramid. You were third overall high score. And Mackenzie. And on top of the pyramid, going three for three, once again, is Maddie. Story of the school bragger. Oh, well, it was that time of the year, pretty hot. And we were in school, and there was this girl, let's just say Bella. Every day she would come and post a TikTok in our classroom. And she would do videos like, oh my gosh, guys, I literally just hit 1,000 followers. She would do it just so that she can show off her followers towards the other students. So our teacher announced that we had to do a project. I wanted to do the project so bad until I heard what it was about. While the teacher was chomping on her gum, she said, okay, class, at the end of the week, I would like you to come individually to the front of the classroom so you can tell the students about you guys. She also mentioned that you had to bring something along to show the class about you boy named let's just say john well for example john he brought video games i knew exactly what bella was gonna bring it was the end of the week and bella was called to the front of the room she kept on bragging about how she had 2,000 followers and everyone was so annoyed then it was my turn to go up to the front of the desk i had no idea what to say but then i To my babysitter, she say I, then I let my kids with her. I'm the type of nigga that a wife your kids sister just to make you the brother that I gotta get rid of. On that cane and able, paramedics came to save you. Uh, but you in a thousand pieces, uh, that AK just one cage you. Diamonds in my watch, call it hard times. You rent yours, I brought mine. Cash. I think I got a case of insomnia, cause I got my eyes open at all times. Chevy St. Color is mustard, Chevy St. Color is ketchup. Yeah. All of my haters look sick, cause they know that I run that checkup. <laughs> just got some ass in the back of my bins. That's my idea of a written collision. Ray Bans on, looking like Ray Childs. I don't need no vision to know what I'm hitting, man. Listen, I don't talk much. But I smash in the booth like white folks when I the Starbucks Got a chocolate mist that tastes like a star crunch And a white girl whose brain can make your heart jump Yeah, you don't really want no smoke You don't really want no smoke No, no You don't really want no smoke You don't really want no smoke No, no smoke Haters always do the least But they always talking the most You don't really want no smoke You don't really want no smoke No, no smoke You don't really want no smoke You don't really want no smoke No, no smoke You don't really want no smoke You don't really want no smoke No, no smoke Careful when saying my name Please just stay in your lane Hey. You don't really want no smoke. You Mickey don't really fucking sparks. No hey. Spit sick words. I don't whisper. In a lip verse, get curved quicker than a fastball by a pitcher. It'll get worse when I continue to rap.
that, but they ain't ready for that. Cause I've been doing everything to work up on the floor and cadence, hating, debating. It is so blatant to see that none of y'all are better than me. So better believe there ain't nothing I can't do. From videos to flows to shows, I am the one that rose the boat. The captain wears my coat. Don't know I gloat, devote my time to make this. And I play the game, it's operation. I'm the shit, you're constipated. I'm related to the best that made it. Who's the goat? It's Miggy in the conversation. I can't wait to take this all away from all the face. I'm falling late, cause shit is dangerous, ayy. You don't want smoke like a playground, get laid out like blueprints for a new house, take a new route. This ain't no carpool lane, bitch. I'm Usain, lift up new grain. This kicks whole cane, rush tracks, new train, get cooked, low main, hang, kill propane. Goddamn, I just really wanna be the man. Hotter than a sweater with sedan, window fan, in the room, put them all in the tune. Bada bing, bada boom, so it's best for you dudes not to step to the kid and invest in the lid to cover your mouth, but you know what I'm about. Hey. So keep my name out of it, yelling it louder so all of y'all hearing me, you don't want no smoke. You don't really want no smoke, you don't really want no smoke, no, no smoke. You don't really want no smoke. You don't really want no smoke. No, no smoke. Haters all but every time I try to move on, on right there, acting like it's in the corner. Maybe you just want me to be as unhappy as you are.
Raiden Money Himalaya Salty cause you failing Born to kill shit No Matt Damon I know you love when I get braggadocious Mad I'm rapping, listen to it You like damn me hopeless Only hope you got Hope nobody fucking notice I just buy the bins I don't grind to push no fucking focus Hold up, bring it back Bitch, I'm in my bag Like a carry-on Sick of naked bitches Sick of sipping Dom, period On that Hanukkah, burning bread, let's have a toast. Mazel tov. I wait a long time, long list of long rhymes. Try so fucking much, yeah, bitch, I'm on my crock eye. All about Kareem bars like Abdul and Klondike. You ain't no me, bitch, stop playing. No cool shit, show boat, I'm parading. Money Himalaya, salty cause you fade that. Born to kill shit, no Matt Damon. Yeah, fuck it, I'm a beamy, ain't no second guessing I could die today, no way I'm living life Always stressing, I don't need no shit Ain't no human centipede I build a kingdom, yeah, my struggle is a centipede I ain't got no time for no pony, no bitch mo Dicking down life, I'm a motherfucking info I've been depressed, bent down like it was 29 Drove across the country just so I could free my mind Leave the past behind, think about my past decision See a better life, all I Trust my vision I'm at peace with who I was and what I will become I'll be me until I die Ain't no switching up You ain't no me, bitch, stop playing No cool ship, show boat, I'm parading Money Himalaya, salty cause you faded Born to kill shit, no Matt Damon Bitch, I'm bad, and he never okay Why y'all mad, big jealous and that's okay nah, I may never be on a Samsung phone commercial but I always let you know when I got some purple You don't care, I move overseas Even though your sister is police You always like one with me You can be my drug dealer boy You can be my drug dealer boy You can be, be, be my drug dealer boy It was filled up with about 28 pounds Clients stacking their bills up When it be fronting them mouths I was getting to work And the work was work More than Jason Worth The perk of the work The hooks and verses Became my first priority In other words Not working was working I would drive out to Colorado Where urban was perfect Sure, I was nervous I would head out With about like 50 some thou On my dash Whole route sweated out like No doubt I'm about right To make enough in two days Pay too much expenses Just to make a drive on Tuesday No dude I would tell Chase We can't get high Do you wait Only driving daylight Get a whole Hotel, if it's too late, wholesale, I would move weight. No sale to a new face. No trail, got a new sale. I would do well in a crew cake. Hey, and the money was crazy. Got my cake up, I let my guard down. I fucking got lazy. Shit. Parking lot, six in the eve. He said, let me flip it real quick. I ain't fixing to leave my clients out front. And he be buying that skunk. Mark, I known you for two years and they lied to you once. I said, that's well and good. But can't be out a couple of pounds. Well, I don't doubt you, but if he bounces and I'm out a stupid amount, I'm feeling wary and I don't feel right. I gotta sit out. What if he's carrying? Pulls it out and fires a couple of rounds. Don't you trust me? He said, and sweat tripped down his brow. Matter of fact, I don't. I thought, but I not in his mouth. He shook his head and frowned. Don't give a fuck if they be back and I ain't slacking. He pulled a gun right out of his jacket and he sat it on his lap and then he looked me in my eye. I handed him my bag and he said he'll be back in five, 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 ten, ten, fifteen, fifteen, twenty. Why the fuck I keep on waiting? He ain't coming back with money. What the hell I'm supposed to do now that I'm short eight grand? I don't know. Call up my supplier like, oh, hey, man. One day you're up, up. one day you're down. down. The life of a drug dealer trying to get 